friends, welcome back to our channel. Uh, we are at Disneyland today. Yay! We have some fun. <laughs> yes, we are. And it is Halloween time at Disneyland. Mm -hmm. um, we haven't been to Halloween at Disneyland Park for a while since they had the um, trick or treat parties. We went there, but now we've been going to Oogie Boogie. So we haven't been to Disneyland with the big pumpkin and everything. Um, so we're excited to go do that and see the characters in their costumes, and we'll have a lot of fun. We want you to join us. So let's go see what they have. Yay!
Yeah, from What's the Galactic Grill. It's like some kind of um, glowing blue slush from Galactic Grill. I don't know the exact name. Since 
on the age of the dinosaurs before returning to Main Street Station. Oh, As we right get yeah. remember that for a safe trip, you need to stay seated. You never know what might be lurking along the rails. Just ahead of New Orleans Square Station, this station also serves Frontierland and Critter Country. If you'll be leaving us here, please remain seated until the train comes to a complete stop. Then watch your step as you're getting off. For those of you continuing on with us, we'll be resuming our trip in just a moment. This is New Orleans Square Station. New Orleans Square. And the young ones must be watched at all times. The waters be cold and deep, and our crew cannot swim a stroke. So whosoever falls overboard will be staying overboard. And it will be duly noted in the ship's law. You may not smoke or be standing on deck fires. The only fire permitted on board is in the galley under the watchful eye of the cook. Attention, marinettes. Further breezes. We sail a true course, south by southwest. Here we go. We're just clearing the busy port of New Orleans and beginning our journey into the great American wilderness. Our vessel for this voyage is the proud sailing ship Columbia, the first American ship to carry the stars and stripes around the world. She's a 10-gun, three-masted merchant ship. It was back in 1787 that she first sailed. all the way around the Horn and sailing onward to the Pacific Northwest Hawaii and China. In the three years it took us to make that journey, the Columbia was more than just a ship to us. She was our life and our home. Ford Midships is the main hatchway leading below decks, where you may see how we lived and worked on the high seas. The galley, captain and crew's quarters are open for your inspection. For the rest of you, we invite you to stay up on deck, feel the wind in your face, and experience the wonders of this land we now know as America. that this very ship braved a sandbar and discovered a mighty river which we named the Columbia after the first ship to sail our waters. Just 
Oh, what's going to happen? Bowman, and the starboard foxhole cannon and prepare to fire a warning shot. So as any curious pirates hide near the shore, we'll know we are well armed. Those of you around the cannon best be stepping back. Way back. For the cannon should be a mite loud, and the gunner's aim be a mite poor. Make ready to fire one. Fire one! Now, that should put some fear in them. Looks like we're safe for now. But I ask our crew and passengers to keep a weather eye out. We don't want the Jolly Roger flying above this fine ship. Indians has set up camp by the river. Since they have no written language, tribal leaders like that wise shaman on the rock over there pass down their wisdom and knowledge through stories and songs. During our voyages, we sometimes stop to barter and trade with these local tribes. Villages like this one have helped many an explorer learn how to survive in this vast frontier. Shipmates, if you haven't done so, it is a good time to visit the crew's quarters below decks to see how sailors of the 1790s lived and worked while on the high seas. The lower decks will be closing when we enter port. Those of you remaining on deck, keep a close eye on the riverbanks where you may be able to see moose, elk, and other wildlife. starboard are the last remains of an old shipwreck. All hands on deck. Stand by to go ashore. Yard man aloft into the foot ropes. Furl the top gallants. Down with the flying jib. Quick ready the bow anchor. 
Stand by all lines. Stand by the bow line, port side. Let go the bow anchor. Let go the cage. Crew, it's been a pleasure serving with you aboard the sailing ship Columbia. The first ship to carry the stars and stripes round the world. You've been a fine crew, and we hope you'll be sailing with us again soon. All hands, prepare to go ashore!
First order may require your service. Are you prepared to join? Good. And you will not betray us. I thought not. You Stay enjoy your day now. Move. Citizens, this is active recon. We are leaving this area. Move on. Enjoy the day. <laughs>
The best for last, the Halloween Scream Along! You're all invited to scream like you're trying to wake the dead! we